The smoke I saw was at the top of these ruins. And Orid's mark said he'd followed a Thunderjaw here. Why would it attack Dawn's grasp, then come to this place? For all their power, everything the old ones built is just crumbling to nothing. Ancient machines all over the mountain. Glad they're dead. But they still give me the creeps. time as a soldier, I only faced handfuls of machines. Remember the numbers that attacked this place. If machines really are attacking settlements now, then the sun them will go the way of the old ones. Echo shell. Nice. centuries ago. Hard to imagine anyone lasting long against all those ancient machines. Damn. That must be the Thunderjaw Orid was following. Looks like these ruins were fortified once. If they didn't keep the machines out then, they won't keep me out now. Looks like there's a ballist out there. Why are there new defenses in the middle of old ruins? Yes. Now it's following me. It's still searching for me. I've got to get up into the ruins, away from that machine.
another target down. An ancient flying machine. Oh no. Ancient machines climbed up that way. I should be able to look at them all. I've never seen machines swarm like that. Or maybe that's what they did.
below that smoke. Please. That's it. That's it.
This better take me up to some answers, not an ambush. No one's home. But they left. What is that? Rod wanted me to find answers. Maybe this is answers. Or it mustn't have seen it, or understood it. Maybe Riddell can explain this device. I should head back to Don's grasp now. You defeated a Thunderjaw? That's what you sent me to do. We sent you for answers. Have the machines stopped coming through the settlement? Well, then I guess I found your answers too. Possibly. Radell? These components were made by the old ones. These... these were made by an Osirum tinker. Osirum? And yet Uruk went to Mother's Tears and Nora territory. Mother's Tears is a settlement in Valley Mead. The Nora abandoned it during the Red Raids. The Nora can't be behind this, can they? The Nora are far too superstitious about the old ones to touch a device like this. And what is that device? It's a high-frequency wireless communication system. A beacon, but for machines. So, that's why Avad Spymaster came all the way out here. You knew you'd find this. I didn't know. I feared. And decisions shouldn't be based on fear. Facts should lead us. So try sharing some facts. The few small lures I've seen have the power to attract only a handful of machines from close by. But this, if there are more of them, then this is a threat to the whole sun. And you think it's a good idea to say all that in front of a shadow Karja? When I found that lure, it was connected to the old one's rooms, to a big metal bowl. Could that have made this lure more powerful? But why did Urid ignore the lure and follow whoever it is back to Nora territory? What's so important about these people? You served in Mother's Tears, didn't you, Reyes? I served where I was sent. Yes, I served there. Then you know the land. The wounds of the Red Raids are still fresh for the Nora. Valley Meat would be an extremely dangerous place for a Shadow Kaja to go. Though, if Urid felt these people were important enough to pursue, we must too. Go on for your brother, for the vow you made to the Sundom, or for yourself. But if you choose to go, do it as a free man. His luminance Avad won't send Kaja soldiers into Nora territory, but I cannot stop someone going there to find their brother. Walk in the light, Reyes, but try not to be seen. 